The reason why I like to come to work is the excitement and uncertainty of cardiac electrophysiology, but most importantly to be able to practice in an environment with people I call my friends. Uh, we really are a team effort here at Kaiser, and I think that that's what is one of our greatest strengths, is that we don't have to be afraid of offering or asking for help from other people, because our prestige, our, our everything else is not dependent upon that. All that we care about is patient care, and the more people that we have involved in the care provides a better experience and a better health care for the patient. Kaiser Permanente is a unique structure. It's a relationship between a health plan, a uh, hospital plan, and a private medical group. I am part of a private medical group called uh, Southern California Permanente Medical Group, and we like to call this Permanente Medicine. The integrated model of the Kaiser system allows easy collaboration between physicians for the care of the patients because every patient is every doctor's patient. Nowhere else would you go to see an electrophysiologist and the first thing you hear is you need a mammogram or you need a colonoscopy and by the way I'm giving you your flu shot. One of the unique aspects of our delivery of care for electrophysiology in Southern California is we have a centralized approach. Kaiser Permanente covers over four million members in Southern California but if any of them need complex EP care they do come to Los Angeles. We feel as though this lends to obviously high volumes, which then translates into high quality with the advantages then of research and teaching. The Royal Review is our weekly educational conference where the fellows present clinical cases and we focus on educational points, uh, interpretation of the complex electrograms, uh, proper techniques for ablation, and also review um, papers that were published. For example, two articles in press have to do with real-life complications from ICD implants and AFib ablation. With this information, we feel like we can better inform patients and consent them for procedures and hopefully share this with the community as well. Hi, Dr. Gupta. How are you? Good, good. Thank you for agreeing to do a video consult. Uh, tell me a little bit about why you're coming in today. This is great. I love it. I don't have to leave my house. Oh, great. With our unique model <laughs> of care, we do have yeah. patients coming from multiple areas in Southern California, and with that can be an inconvenience of travel. One way that we've addressed this is by doing virtual consults, and we've been doing this for years over the telephone, but now are able to do this uh, with video consults so that we have patients coming from as far as 60, 70 miles away, but from the convenience of their own home. It's now on your screen. Uh, do you see this article that I pulled up? I do, yes. We have a recent article hot off the press, so to speak. It's actually waiting for a publication. Uh, this is also possible only because of our integrated EMR. All the data that we need for the patient, from their EKGs to their echocardiograms, are all at the tip of our fingers, so we can have all the information and the ability to do a full consultation with, and minimize the travel for the patient. Having access to some of these new technologies in the clinical trials, um, Electrophysiology as a field is really kind of expanding into more of the structural base as well. One of the ones we're doing is the left atrial appendage closure programs, which we offer both the, the lariat epicardial approach as well as the traditional watchman, as well as the amulet study as well here. Other things that I'm really proud of is the neurohormonal uh, modulation program that we have, such as the bilateral stellate ganglion resection program for refractory VT, and working with our partners, really bringing in people from different fields together in order to treat these patients in an effective way. So Kaiser has a, a national cardiac registry, and it's unique in that it really is our primary source for all the hardware that's implanted in our patient population. We use this registry to track outcomes and help us when it comes to, for example, device recalls, um, and we can determine whether devices are performing according to standards. So every evening we have what we call sign out, and this is an opportunity for the docs, the fellows, the EP hospitalists all come together to discuss the cases of the day. This is a time uh, for education for our fellows, continuing education for all of us as practitioners to help outside cardiologists understand what we do in the treatment of these complex patients. So by getting everyone's opinion and everyone knowing the patient, you have multiple different ways of looking at it and offering different techniques. Um, and quite honestly, I think we're better as a group than you are as an individual. 
Um, I believe this electrophysiology group is unique uh, in our collaboration um, every day in our daily sign out. is an opportunity for us to work together, but also to build camaraderie amongst the group. Uh, and I think that's one of the reasons we work so well together. We have excellent chemistry in our group, and that comes from the top down, from our management, our doctors, and, and everyone is really like family.